All right, this is Brent Marvick with BP Kitchen Equipment. We have here a 2017 Bezerba GSP HD Slicer. This is Bezerba's automatic model. Comes with the illuminated knob package. So that whenever the blade is open, it flashes red. Whenever it's closed, and you're good to get in there and touch it with your hands, it's green. Uh, this will not be an in-depth walkthrough of the differences between the models, so I'm not going to show you um, the differences between this one or a manual, vice versa. I'm also not going to be talking a whole lot about what it is that we do here at BP Kitchen Equipment. All I'm going to be showing you is the general cosmetic condition of this slicer if you are interested in this model. Uh, after that, I'm going to uh, include a brief little video of it running. Um, and if you have any other questions about the slicer, please uh, just give me a call and uh, do my best to answer them. So, uh, since this is just a video of the cosmetic condi condition of the slicer, I'll start off on this side. Uh, this slicer is from 2017, so it has a little bit of wear here in the plastic, uh, here on the arm. Uh, it's actually got relatively, it's relatively free of wear um, here on the left side, which is cool. Um, honestly, not a whole lot there, it's about average wear. Right here does have some more scuffs. Looks like somebody wiped it down and ran it forward like that. I'm not sure you can see that. Yeah. Um, under in here, uh, which this is actually the channel that directs uh, directs liquid uh, backwards. Uh, that is in really good shape. Uh, normally you see some pooling around here, uh, but it is uh, it's definitely taken care of. Uh, the gauge plate is in excellent shape. They typically are. Um, this has very little uh, wear, which is awesome. And the face of the slicer is also in pretty good shape. Um, it's here, there's some slight wearing right there, but uh, the foil's in excellent shape. It's got a brand new, a brand new uh, waterproofing cover. The knob's also in pretty good shape. As for the right side of it, it's also in really good condition. Basically no scratches here, also no scratches on the arm there. So the gauge plate is about average. Um, there isn't a whole lot of nicks in it, uh, but, but it isn't uh, relatively free of nicks either. So uh, that means that uh, between the gauge plate looking decent and there being uh, relatively nothing else in the slicer besides uh, the little scratches we showed on the other side of the gauge plate, um, we're going to sell this as, uh, as a good condition. And yeah, uh, it does come with a brand new aftermarket meat grip um, that you can replace if you want to. All right, now let's show the operation of the slicer. So it is currently plugged in and the gauge plate is closed, as you can see. Turn the slicer on. Now you can turn just the blade on, you see right here, flash red can see that blade running back and forth. One of the cool things about these automatics is that even when it's in manual mode, it's assisted, which is really nice. Now let's run it in slow. Automatic. Put it up a notch. stroke lengths and the shortest. There we go. All right, yeah, the slicer is in excellent shape. It's very quiet and this bar has been lubricated and uh, ready to go. If you have any questions about this slicer, please feel free to reach out to me. My number can be found anywhere on our website. Um, Thank you very much, and uh, yeah, let me know if I can help.